Following a disappointing fourth installment, the future of the Expendables movie seems less certain than ever, but the franchise may actually have wasted its best casting replacement back in 2014. After four movies, the combination of Jason Statham and Sylvester Stallone as the leading actors in the ensemble action franchise has run its course, with the pair's appearance in the critically panned Expend 4 Bless generally regarded as the nadir of the series. However, irrespective of whether further Expendables films follow, the saga actually had the ideal chance to reset thanks to one actor's Expendables 3 involvement. Although the Expendables series' greatest strength has been its extensive ensemble, Jason Statham and Sylvester Stallone are widely acknowledged as the series' main players. Not only have the duo been ever-present throughout the franchise, but Stallone co-wrote the series' first three installments, with Statham receiving a producer credit for Expend 4 Bless. However, the fourth movie's critical and financial failure suggests that moving on from the pair represents the series' best future. Unfortunately, one potentially inspired replacement is no longer a viable option. Glenn Powell's Thorne could have been the Expendables' replacement for Stallone and Statham. He was the natural successor for the franchise. Glenn Powell in the Expendables 3 image. After first appearing in the Expendables 3, Glenn Powell's Thorne was ideally placed to serve as the series Stallone and Statham replacement. A charismatic combat veteran and hacker, Thorne formed part of the so-called Young Expendables, alongside the likes of Ronda Rousey's Luna and Kellen Lutz's John Smiley. After impressing the older members of the team, the new members were welcomed into the fold in the Expendables 3's ending, potentially paving the way for their future franchise involvement. However, while any of the crew could have been a suitable Stallone and Statham replacement, Powell's Thorne really stood out. Despite not being a big name in 2014, Powell stole the show as the effervescent Thorne, utilizing his skills behind the scenes to bring down the antagonistic Stonebanks. His future career, especially his supporting role in Top Gun, Maverick, has further cemented Powell's action credentials, while his starring role in Richard Linklater's Hitman confirmed that he has the potential to lead a major blockbuster. However, despite Powell's clear prospects as a performer and Thorne's status within The Expendables after The Expendables 3, the character did not return for The Expend 4 Bless, wasting a major opportunity to finally move beyond Stallone and Statham. The Expendables franchise has no chance of bringing back Glenn Powell now. He's already outgrown the series. Given how Powell's star has risen since 2014, it's easy to say in retrospect that the franchise missed a major opportunity. However, while some series might be able to correct such a mistake, it seems highly unlikely that the Expendables franchise will get a similar chance. Expend 4 Bless was a major disappointment both critically and commercially, placing the series' entire future in doubt. The movie made just $50 million against a $100 million budget, while scoring just 14% on review aggregator Rotten Tomatoes.